As the city of Mobile continues to address a backlog of capital improvement projects, News 5's Emily DeVoe takes a closer look at what projects are getting done and which ones are in limbo. Another round of $21 million in infrastructure spending is on the way after City Council approved the plan for the upcoming fiscal year 2018. For the past two years, the number of projects has skyrocketed because of the penny sales tax, which is set to expire next year. The City of Mobile has a website set up so you can track projects like the sidewalks here on McGregor. But if you look, a lot of these projects are still left over from fiscal year 2016. When we approved that first year, of capital projects. That's the first time we'd had that level of work come into the city for our staff to begin to execute. Perhaps one of the most anticipated projects yet to be completed is the resinking of the traffic lights on Airport Boulevard. It's finally out of the design phase and awaiting a construction contract in the next few weeks. Those projects have a life cycle of their own, so they may have started in 16, but they may not complete until sometime here in 17, and some larger projects may go on into 18, so the money's committed the project might still be going on. What's uncertain is what will happen in the future if the penny sales tax hits the end of the road in 2018. In Mobile, Emily DeVoe, News 5. Mayor Sam Jones' administration added the penny sales tax in 2010. City Council members have time to decide whether or not to extend the sales tax again because it doesn't expire until September of next year.